the population is more and more concerned about uh, climate change. And um, I believe that uh, consumers will put a lot of pressure on the industries and we have to decarbonize our energy. I think that this um, will change completely the game for hydrogen. If you look at 2030, 2050, the world needs green hydrogen. That's not because we want it for ourselves. We want, we want it because customers are demanding it of our customers, as well as shareholders. For us to achieve those goals, we need green hydrogen. 18% of the world's energy will come from hydrogen in 2050 if we have green hydrogen. And that'll allow us to help the world reduce 2.5 gigatons of carbon. We have to have an energy carrier that has a capability to store the energy and to distribute in a good way. And here, hydrogen has very good uh, properties and is very suited to it. Uh, hydrogen is one of the key fuels to consider on the path to net zero emissions. Industry has been a driving force in the development of technology required for the use of hydrogen. Technology is ready for the next step of large-scale uh, utilization. Uh, technology alone cannot deliver net zero emissions. Uh, support from the policy makers and incentive mechanisms are required to generate the demand for low carbon or carbon neutral products.